Who doesn't love a lazy day, right? I definitely do. First things first, I always love myself a nice cup of coffee to get things going. And for my lazy day outfit, I like to rock a super comfy tank top and my go-to everyday Daniel Wellington watch. I love the strap and that it matches my lazy day outfit perfectly. A great thing about lazy days is pampering yourself. I'll be giving myself a nice exfoliation with my Acure Organics Brightening Facial Scrub. But before I do, a great beauty tip I always do is just steam my face for a few minutes before exfoliating. The steam really helps open the pores, so when I do use the scrub, it works even better. This brightening scrub is also perfect for removing dirt and oil, and it works for all skin types too. And I'm going to give myself a nice scrub for about 30 seconds and then rinse and pat dry. Next up, for toning my skin, I've been using the Sensuals Radiance Toning Mist. I love that it's 100% natural and it smells like geranium and sandalwood, which is amazing. I'm going to spray this all over my face and neck and press in the toner so that it absorbs right into the skin. And now that we're heading into winter season, I like to switch up my moisturizer for an ultra hydrating one, and that's when I bring out my Dr. Hoshka Rose Day Cream. You only need a pea sized amount, and it's one of the best moisturizers i found that have really helped hydrate my skin during the colder months. And whenever I'm having a lazy day, I always like to exfoliate my body because I tend to forget about it when I'm in the shower, so I'll be using the Clarice Rapid Detox Charcoal Exfoliant for my hands. This stuff is amazing to get rid of impurities and helps eliminate any dead skin cells, and I also love using this around my cuticles to get my nails looking extra soft and supple. Once I've scrubbed enough, I'm going to rinse it off and voila! Extra smooth and silky hands. To give my nails a little extra pizzazz, I love playing around with nail designs on a lazy day. So here I'm using my Formula X nail color in Ignite for a beautiful little accent flower on my thumbnail. Taking a skewer stick, I'm going to dip the ends into the bottle and just make five little dots in a circle to create the flower. I'm also loving this color which is perfect for the winter season and it's long lasting too. I'll also add a light colored dot to the middle of the flower to finish it off. When it comes to my hair on a lazy day, I just like to give it a nice brush through and I'm going to apply the Garnier Fructis Sleek and Shine Sleek Primer Style Prep and spritz this all over my hair to tame frizz and it makes my hair feel super soft and easy to style. And then I'm going to do my go-to lazy side braid and fluff it out. Now let's get to our lazy day makeup look. Grabbing my beauty blender, I'm going to apply Maybelline's Fit Me foundation all over the face for light coverage. And this is one of my recent drugstore favorites, so if you're looking for a new foundation, this is definitely one to try out. Now for my brows, I'll be using this super cute Pixie by Petra Brow Powder Trio. It comes with three matte shades, so you can mix and match and customize the perfect brow color for yourself. What I also really liked about this trio is that I can use the darker shades for any bald spots like my scar, so it's definitely nice to have a few colors to help fill it in. For the eyes, I'm going to keep it simple. I'm going to curl the lashes and apply one of my recent favorite mascaras by CoverGirl called the Super Sizer. I just love it because it makes my short lashes look longer and no clumping, which is a plus. For a natural contour, I'm going to use Tata Harper's Cream Contour in very bronzing underneath the cheekbones. This is perfect for my lazy day routine because it's super easy to blend and it's also really hydrating too. And I'm going to go one step further, I'm going to lightly contour the sides of the nose as well. And for a bit of color to the cheeks, I'm going to apply my e.l.f. Cosmetics Blush to the apples of the cheeks for some added rosiness. And for that extra glow to the skin, I'm going to use Tata Harper's Very Illuminating Highlight on the bridge of the nose, on the brow bone, and on the top of the cheekbones. And last but not least, for the lips, I'll be using my CoverGirl O oh Sugar Vitamin Infused Balm in Candy. I love this color. It's super subtle and perfect for my lazy day look. And now I'm going to tuck away all my lazy day beauty supplies into my Ipsy Glam Bag. And if you guys are interested, I'll have a link down below to ipsy.com where you can find some of the products I used in this video. And now we're done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and had fun hanging out with me while I showed you what I get up to on my lazy days. I love you guys and be sure to subscribe, like, and comment if you want to see more videos like this. And if you want to see my latest video, click it here and watch it now.